In this video, I'm going to show you how to do this really awesome camera zooming effect, and that is right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's get right into the video. So once we're inside of Adobe Premiere Pro, we can begin by just dragging in some footage. And as you can see, I've already got some footage on my timeline here. So this is just a slow motion clip of me doing a backflip in London. Now the screen zoom effect is a really simple and really effective way of adding character and style to your video. So let me show you how to do that right now. So we're gonna first begin by selecting the video on the timeline. We'll go up to the video effects tab and the motion tab in the top left side of Premiere Pro. Now you want to go ahead and you want to find the point where you want to add this screen zoom. I'm gonna add that around here. We'll create a brand new keyframe on scale and position. Then we'll move over five or six keyframes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now I'm gonna increase the scale to around 120. You want to keep this number quite small. You don't want to go all the way up to 150 because then it becomes a bit aggressive and it looks really fake. So keep this to below 120. Now, if we play this back, you can see we've got this screen zoom effect happening. And although the screen is zooming, the effect is not quite finished yet. We need to go ahead and manipulate these keyframes in order to take this to the next level. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna select all of those keyframes that we just created. We'll right click on one of those keyframes, go down to temporal interpolation, and we're going to select ease in. Now, when we play this back, that'll be a lot softer and a lot smoother. Cool, that looks really awesome. Of course, you can slow this down by separating the keyframes a little bit. So if I wanted to slow this down, we could pull this right keyframe over to the right. Or if I wanted to make this faster, then you could just decrease the gap between those keyframes. So there's only a two frame gap between these two keyframes now. And as you can see, that's a bit aggressive and a little bit ugly. So we'll go ahead and we'll increase that distance again. And as you can see, we've got this really subtle screen zoom. Now, if you wanted to zoom back out, all you have to do is create a brand new keyframe right there by pressing this stopwatch icon, move over a few frames, and then we can just pull the scale back to 100%. And if we play this back, we've got subtle zoom in and subtle zoom out. Of course, you can be more aggressive with this. You don't have to have that massive gap in between. So you can do zoom in, hold, zoom out. And there you go. This is a really easy way of adding a little bit of extra character to your footage. And you can do that right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. Of course, if you don't have Premiere, then you can pretty much use these techniques in any editing software and you'll achieve a very similar result. So the next time you want to take your video to the next level in the edit, go ahead and use this subtle zoom in effect inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. It's super easy and it's going to look really awesome. So thank you for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching it. I hope you found it helpful. And if you did, then please do help me out by pressing that subscribe button. Check out the previous video. And of course, I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. See you there.